All right. I'm pretty excited about this one. This is a moment 17 years in the making. I have been looking forward to this moment for so long. I literally gave up hope. The last time I drank Pepsi Blue, George W. Bush was still president. So I woke up this morning and I called the usual stores, Walmart, Kroger's, and I asked both of them about whether or not they had Pepsi Blue in stock. <clears throat> both of them still didn't have it. So I didn't even bother calling Save-A-Lot. Because I was like, okay, they didn't have it yesterday. Walmart and Kroger's didn't have it yesterday. They don't have it today. Save-A-Lot's probably not going to have it. So I didn't even bother. I was just like, alright, fine, whatever. Eventually, I'm sure I'll see it in the stores somewhere, and when I do, I'll grab it. But then, just by chance, my wife went to save a lot today to buy whatever it was she went to go buy. And while she was there, she found it. A whole stack of Pepsi Blue. So she picked up three different six pack bottles she didn't tell me about it she waited till she got home to surprise me because she knew i would absolutely shit and i did as soon as i saw them in the back of the van i drew the biggest smile you could possibly imagine i grabbed the six packs in my arms i literally fucking hugged them i hugged them and squeezed them and i was so happy to see them a brand it was like seeing a friend i hadn't seen and over a decade because that's basically what it was a friend i had not seen in over a decade and even right now as i'm sitting here recording this video with a bottle of pepsi blue in my hand surrounded by other bottles of pepsi blue i still cannot believe that this is in fact a reality how could this finally come to be how could this be true it is so totally unbelievable and yet, here it is. I haven't drank it yet. I had to save the moment for right now. To capture it on video, alone, just me, my bottle, my camera. So I can document the exact moment. When my lips finally touch this bottle once again. And I'll always be able to look back at this moment and be like, yes. This was the moment I had been waiting for. So I waited for my wife to go to sleep. Because this is a very personal thing for me. It really is. Very nostalgic. Lots and lots of nostalgia. And now it's just me. And it's time to go ahead and open up this bottle and finally get that taste in my mouth that I've been waiting for once again after all these years. I'm nervous. If I was standing, my, my knees would be weak right now. Honestly, they would. It's going to take courage to open this bottle. And go ahead and do it. It's, it's exciting, but scary at the exact same time. And to be honest, I'm just glad that you are here to share this experience with me. So now let's go ahead. Oh, first off, let me show you the bottle. They updated the uh, design quite a bit since 2004. This is what it's looking like now. All right. 
Let's go ahead and open this up. And finally get that taste again. God, it still smells the same. Let's do it. <laughs> there it is. There's that taste I've been waiting for all these years. God, that brings back so many memories. The apartment my dad used to live at when I was a kid. My cousin Josh and I walking around at night, drinking bottles of this, just bullshitting, telling each other just crazy ass stories. God, the excitement that I got every time I went to the store bought a new 12 pack or six pack or whatever it was that I got of this like it's all just coming back to me honestly I can I could I can just I can remember it's like I'm there again just a little kid without a care in the world And I'm back there once again. This is amazing. This is truly something special. I was so worried that I would drink it, taste it again, and it wouldn't actually be the same as it was back in the day. I was so worried, but it is. It is exactly the same as it was back in the day, 100%. God. This was so worth the wait. And the build-up and the excitement a lot of things in life will disappoint you you'll be let down by a lot of things but I'm, I'm glad to see that in the end one of those things that disappoint you is it's not Pepsi Blue it's not Pepsi Blue will not disappoint you 17 years later it'll be exactly the way you remember it it's very reliable like that and I wish this could remain a permanent item to where they'll just have it for all eternity because it deserves to be permanent. But it's okay. We have this limited amount of time to where we can just enjoy it for a little bit and go back in time a little bit. And go back to a younger time. It's okay okay that it's limited because as long as we get to see it again it's just it's worth it even if it means losing it again just to know that we got to enjoy it finally it's worth it and you know something else on top of it I mean being a total trip through time, a total nostalgic trip. It also tastes like 2004.